Do you have low back pain? If you have low back pain, you need core stability. Today, I'm going over three levels of supine core stabilization. But before we start, we have to know how to activate our transverse abdominus muscle, or TA for short. If you don't activate your TA, these exercises do absolutely nothing for your low back pain. It is super easy to activate your TA. You know when you feel too bloated to fit into an old pair of pants? You suck in your stomach to try to button your pants. And guess what? When you suck in your stomach, you are activating your TA. It is easy to suck in your stomach for one second, but it's a little bit different when you have to suck in your stomach for a whole minute. That's why these exercises aren't as simple as you think. The first exercise is the supine march. Lie down on your back. Bend your knees with your feet flat on the floor. Tighten your TA and keep the tension in your abdominals muscles. Pick up one leg and then put it back down. Pick up the other leg and then put it back down. Repeat for 10 repetitions. This is the easiest level of supine core stabilization. When you do these exercises as well as other core exercises, please make sure that you are breathing and not holding your breath. If you hold your breath, you will get tired much faster. A second exercise is a sequential march and lower exercise. You start in the same starting position as the first exercise, lying down on your back, knees bent, feet flat on the floor. Now activate your TA, pick one leg up, and then while keeping that leg up, pick up the other leg as well. Put the first leg down, and then the second leg down. Repeat for 10 repetitions. The third exercise is the supine toe taps. This one is a little bit different. You start in the same starting position, lying down on your back, bend the knees, feet flat on the floor. But now, activate your TA first. Bring one leg up, and then bring the other leg up. This is your new starting position. Keep your hips and knees at about 90 degrees angle, keeping your TA activated. Slowly lower one foot down and use the toes to gently touch the floor and immediately come back to the starting 90-90 position and then slowly lower the other foot down to touch the floor and then immediately come back to the starting position repeat for 10 repetitions there are more progressions to this supine core stabilization series such as supine heel taps supine butt kicks However, if you are able to do 3 sets of 10 repetitions of supine toe taps, your core stability is usually stable enough for most daily activities such as standing, walking, or other light daily activities. If you want to completely recover from your lower back pain, please consult with your local physical therapist or physiotherapist for a personalized rehab program. Please also check out my other video for my top 3 stretching exercises for low back pain.